How can stress make you fat? Well, this is some excellent work that was done by Pamela Peake originally at Yale University, and it's pretty much accepted at this point that there is a hormone in our body called cortisol, and it actually is a kind of glitch in trying to build muscle or lose fat. What basically, as I was telling you earlier, all hormones are like internet mail systems with, with a, a something in the message center. And the message of cortisol is break down muscle and store fat, particularly around the middle. So what increases stress? Caretaking too much caretaking. Many women that I have talked to and lectured to and, 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 and been in the audiences of my lectures and have written to me are people who put a tremendous amount of effort into service for other people and very little attention on themselves. That kind of caretaking raises stress hormones. Not taking time for yourself raises stress hormones. Not sleeping enough, which is what everybody does, raises stress hormones. Uh, too much of the wrong foods raise stress hormones, relationships, being stuck in traffic, going to the soccer game. All of these things raise this hormone that was meant to be a kind of turbocharging. It was meant to be, hey, I see a woolly mammoth. Oh, here comes my adrenaline. It allows me to run or run up a tree or fight the woolly mammoth off with a, with a stick. So it's a fight or flight hormone. It wasn't meant to be on 24 hours a day. And the fact that it is on so much has actually contributed to our weight gain. And Reducing stress is probably one of the best weight loss strategies you can possibly do.